done. So I am on a great shopping trip to H&M and I thought it might be a good idea to show you what kind of fall jackets they have. So I'm going to go ahead and try a few on for you, give you the prices, and just give you my input, tell you what I think about them. Here we go. So this first one is a flight jacket, um, a flight bomber jacket, and it's got kind of like a bow shirling inside, and it is a um, non-leather jacket, so it's faux. I'm going to try it on real quick so you guys can see what it looks like on. So again, this is what it looks like on, and you've got the nice collar here, which I think they made exaggerated, so it's really large, and it's not a crop jacket, so you can kind of tell, um, you know, from the behind what it would look like on. So it's kind of cute for $30. Um, I already have one that's similar to this. It's an actual shirling, but it's kind of like a grayish brown color, so this might be something that I would add to my fall collection. Okay, so this next one is $34.95, and this one is more like an army surplus jacket. So I'm going to try this one on for you and let you know what I think. I really like the feel of it, and I like that it's got the hood that zips inside of the collar because it makes it look more utilitarian, so I'll try this one on for you. Okay, so this is a big trend for this fall. So this is like the army surplus jacket. You want to make sure that you've got enough space in it um, to kind of move around. And this one actually cuffs up on the sleeve. But I think it's pretty cute. I may consider getting this one. Okay. Well, the next two that I'm going to show you are pretty much the same thing in terms of the military army surplus jacket. So I'm going to just give you the other two options because you have three options all together if you're looking to follow that fall trend. So this one is $34 and it's belted and it's a little bit more true to kind of the army green color. So I'll try this one on for you and see what you think about it. This is that jacket on. Um, I could probably use a larger size than this one. I think the largest size they have is a six up, so it's a little snug on me. It's got like big buttons on it, and again, it's got the belt too. So it's kind of a mixture between an army surplus and a trench. You know, you don't have to hold the button. Okay, so this last one I think is the best one out of the Army Navy surplus. It's also the most expensive. Um, this one is $49.95. It does have the hood that sits into the collar as well. Um, and then the nice detail on the shoulders also and plenty of pockets. And then it's also got the drawstring at the bottom. So I'll try this one on for you and uh, we'll see how you like it. This is actually, I think, the best make for your buck. So it's $49, but it's true to color as far as the army green is concerned. And it's got the great color, and it's got plenty of pockets on it and the drawstring, so it makes it more utilitarian and more on trend. Hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me to the fitting room at H&M, and I will see you next time. Bye!